Good day and welcome back to the channel everybody. This is Arm Tile Life. We do videos of firewood, tree jobs, and a bit of outdoor exploring. Today we are out here in the mountains uh, area. We're out here on a cutting block that uh, has been finished up here and they got uh, left tons of this uh, dead stand. We got uh, all the split wood that we got uh, gathered up here. It's uh, pretty high up on the mountain so I decided to leave it out here for a few days. It's been really wet and uh this is the first morning i've actually trusted this road to actually come up here on the truck we were bringing out the quad but uh we got pretty much all this stuff i'm just gonna turn you guys we got pretty much all this stuff off this one pile here as you guys can see all of our quad tracks we were pulling the trees out of here but we got quite a bit out of here we still got a ton more in here but there is some nice thick ones right in here i'm not gonna walk all the way in there I've got a busy day here but as you guys can see those are just beautiful poles so we're eventually going to come back for those there's still a few more in here that we're going to gather get it gather out but uh we got the majority there some really thick guys that we decide to leave but uh they left a few pieces as you guys can see kind of right up there but uh not too much there's I eventually want to go out grab those. There's probably good two or three cords worth of trees on that pile right up there. I went to go look at them and they're all nice beautiful ones. There's probably about three or four layers actually going inside that pile there. And then uh, just these ones as we go down, they're quite littered with some nicer chunks. They're not uh, full tree lengths, but uh, they range from about uh, four four to about 12 foot long pieces. So we're gonna eventually uh, come back up here when it gets more drier and start pulling some of those out and then just hauling those home as uh, fuller logs and we'll be putting those to the processor. But for today, we are out here. We're gonna be uh, yeah, hauling out all this wood. It's probably gonna take a few trips. Here's our wood that we got. We got uh, close to three cords in here. Some very, very nice wood in here. It was a few days, about, well, this was one day worth of splitting and then we did, uh, got some more work down there. But as we go back down, we got a, almost like a kilometer drive going down this hill. It's pretty steep. So hopefully, uh, hopefully our brakes are working today. But as Turk is off somewhere out here, we're gonna get loaded up. Alright, so we're all loaded up here. We got a pretty good load on here. We have to get us trapped down. This is way over probably a uh, weight limit on this truck, but good haul out. We still got pretty much two rows. We just uh, digged a little bit out of that one row. The second load we come out here for, uh, we might have to throw a little bit on our back seat. We're probably going to grab a little bit more of, uh, we just got some, just got some 16 inch blocks. Just down there, we're probably going to grab those just on the way out. We're going to put those in the back seat on this time. Come back out for a second round, load up on this stuff, and then we might even still come back out for uh, a third round here today. But it is hot. I'm going to get out of here. This is, uh, we're filled with mosquitoes out here. I'm going to be bringing some bug repellent next time I come out here today. But uh, yeah, let's get out of here. All right, guys, so round two, we're out here for. I wasn't too sure if we're actually going to be able to make it out. As we were coming out here, we hit a big rainstorm. Uh, as you guys can see, it's uh, pretty much traveling right there. We didn't get hit at all on this mountain. It was pretty much, as I was driving down this uh, down the road just to get before the block, it was about uh, three kilometers just before you seen where it pretty much just ended and this whole part didn't uh, get hit. So we kind of lucked out there. So we're going to grab the last little bit of our wood here. And uh, apparently I got an extra sale to going out here this evening. So I was going to come out here for a third load. But uh, we'll see if that we might do a late load tonight. Just grab some rounds from at the bottom there. But uh, we'll see. We're going to get all this firewood though out uh, 
on this load for sure, even if we have to stack it in the back seat there. But we're gonna get that done up here. Mosquitoes are a lot more nicey here. Turks enjoying the little so bit of shade. Last that little we have. bit, I'll load it up here. We got our nice rose all on the back. We got, we are completely filled up back there. We have to put Turk in the front here. And the remainder that we couldn't fit is pretty much arm load and a little bit. I'm not gonna put on any it anywhere. Uh, we still gotta get the boy in there, otherwise it's gonna be on our lap. So we're just gonna leave that. We'll be out here again to collect more wood for sure. So if somebody takes it, somebody takes it. It's not that big of an issue, but we got the majority of it. But we're gonna head out of here because we got some more kind of heavier clouds rolling in here again. So we're gonna get out of here before it gets uh, mucky or whatnot. Catch you guys back to the yard though. But hopefully you guys enjoyed that. That's pretty much how we gather up all this wood here. Right now I am loading up the truck here to do a few bundles in the yard, which are going to be coming up in our next video. I'm going to show you guys how we do our bundles for our roadside stand there. We don't usually do bundles, but uh, for our roadside stand, we uh, made it an exception. So uh, hopefully you guys stick around and uh, watch that one. But we'll talk to you guys again next Tuesday. Thanks for tuning into Arms High Life. Bye guys. Answer to everything.